there's a revolution coming to YouTube and is being brought on by President Trump. Because of the criticism President Trump has been getting from uh, Twitter, he's now looking into uh, YouTube, Twitter, and Facebook to see if they deserve the privilege called Section 230 right there, of being shielded from lawsuit. Why would they be shielded from lawsuit? Because they're supposed to be a non-critical, no editorial, no censorship venue. And now there's been thousands of complaints registered against these entities for their political censorship. Once this gets revoked, President Trump revokes their Section 230 privileges, YouTube is not going to go back to what it was before in the beginning. Just an open platform for people to uh, put their material on their videos and without them doing any censorship. They're not going to go back to that. They've come too far they are now going to become recognized publishers like the New York Times, CNN, MSNBC, and uh, Fox News. And what that means that now they can be sued for their content, but they have the privilege of now openly selecting their content. They're probably going to uh, select uh, two types of content. One is the uh, how do you type of content. That's how do you fix your roof? How do you fix your plumbing? How do you tie your shoes? Okay, no, that is non-political content. The other they will accept is liberal content. Just like the New York Times wants liberal content only. They don't want, don't even bother to bring your conservative articles for a review by the New York Times. They don't want them. They want liberal points of view. Well, YouTube, now that the mask is torn off, they are going to only want liberal points of view. And you try to submit a conservative point of view video, it's not going to be accepted. It's going to be rejected. So that's the new uh, road that YouTube is going down. But what is going to happen, this leaves open for a new type of content to come back on the internet. The kind of content that was there 20 years ago. Where you could say what you want, make the kind of videos that you want without censorship from YouTube or from a, a new cre uh, creator of internet uh, material. So this means that new entities are going to come on the internet and do the function that YouTube, Twitter, and Facebook used to do. There'll be uh, sites without censorship, except for pornography and uh, uh, inciting revolution. But we're going to go back to an open and free internet again, and it won't be too far away.